morning, you guys. So before I left for work today, I started off with my typical coffee and hot chocolate. Today, for feeling two, having a peanut butter bar. I'm having a little bit of a Powerade Zero. My stomach was not 100% yesterday and I felt a little dehydrated today. So although I could have just had regular water, I decided to do a Powerade because there is a little bit of sodium in here, 240 milligrams and um, there's two and a half servings. So I'll definitely get a little bit of sodium back in my day. Um, have all my fuelings with me right now. We have five new um, caregivers that are being onboarded. So I stopped off this morning and got some cookies and donuts and some fruit and things. And we spread out um, some nice platters and have pitchers of ice water in there for them. They're all doing their onboarding now. I have to do skills with them in a little while. So uh, exciting, exciting. How cute is this? <laughs> a little post-it pad. Somebody put this on my desk. I don't know which one of uh, my team members did, but I thought this was such a cute little thing. And yeah, so it's raining here. It's Thursday. One more day until the weekend. And so Monday will be my new weigh-in day day because the day after Easter I restarted <laughs> so we will see where I'm at but um clothes are fitting better feeling better sleeping better and just all around um refocused and hopefully nothing will deter me right I'm still on that mission for June 20th it's an office day today so normally I'm not sitting here in the office I'm usually out in the field uh, but I do have a couple of referrals that came in so I want to book my assessments and get that going um, business is doing amazing guys. We are well over the expectation, uh, that was set forth by our CFO. So, uh, whew, it's going to be a good year. I am so excited for December to just celebrate this business. Uh, in August, we will officially be open a year, which is just absolutely nuts. Um, we have increased our staff. We have increased business um office space we have it's just i love it i'm so excited and so proud of my baby senior nest all right so um i'm gonna put my glasses on i'm leaning over because my chair is a little bit high today so i'm gonna put on my glasses i'm gonna get to work see you guys at the next fueling so i'm way behind on my fuelings right now um it's 2.30, ah, cinnamon swirl. Just made it here at work. You can do it too, stay focused. All right, so packing up for the day. My desk is nice and clean. I haven't eaten anything since that cinnamon swirl cake. So I'm a little behind. Oh my God, my bag is so heavy, look at this. We're gonna make up for that when we get home. It's gonna be leading green time. And let me lock up, let me close the light. All right, see you another day. All right, let's go home. I'm driving, you're smiling, just really doing nothing. That's the thing I like about you. It's our way, Route 66, and we keep on driving. We just do what we want to do. Yeah. Got the green goddess chicken salad. Avocado, tomato, chicken, pickled onions, lettuce, bacon bits, hard-boiled egg, and the green goddess dressing on the side. I just poured one on top. So I'm sitting here in the parking lot. <laughs> eating because I'm hungry. I didn't think I would make it home. It's almost about a 45 minute ride. So uh, because it's raining and all of the above, I'm just going to have this right now. All right, I'm home and it's a couple of hours later. I just made myself the brownie nice and hot from the microwave. It is pouring out here. I don't know if you can see it, but it's really, really bad. <clears throat> it's coming down. I actually went home a different way because I was afraid. I don't know. I just had this this vibe not to go home the normal way. I don't know why, but if you ever get that, just follow, follow your feeling. They say, follow your gut. I always do. I don't know why. 
So I went home a little bit of a longer way, but I got home safe. And that's all that matters. And I'm gonna go eat my brownie now and I will see you at the last fueling. So the brownie was so good. And I'm waiting for Jess to come home. He's on his way. In fact, I think I hear his truck now. Yep, there he is. Hubby's home. All right, well, I was gonna do a little bit of a clip here, but you know, when your husband comes home, I'm gonna give you a piece of advice for you ladies. When your husband comes home, I don't care how busy your day was, meet him at the door, make him feel loved and special because he is. For you men out there, do that for your wives. It makes such a difference when someone feels loved and that someone was waiting for them. Even though I've only been home for a little while, I still am gonna go to the door and I'm gonna unlock it. And when he comes home, he gets a big hug and a kiss. <laughs> That's just the way we are. So I'm gonna go do that and I'll see you in a little while. All right, we're at the last fueling and I'm gonna do a hot chocolate. I'm in the mood. So we're gonna do a hot chocolate and a decaf coffee and call it a day. So the reason I'm doing the hot chocolate is because it's not too filling for me. I want something hot like a coffee and we're going to cuddle up and watch a movie. And that'll be the end of the night. I'm glad you stuck with me for this day. I'll see you hopefully tomorrow. If not, definitely over the weekend. We uh, have a lot of fun stuff planned. So remember to stay focused and remember as always, we can do this. Yes, we can. As long as we do it together. That's what we're doing. I'll see you guys either tomorrow or the weekend. Bye-bye.